Hey everybody, welcome back, bringing you a brand new Game On series. This time we're doing a little Enslaved Odyssey to the West. Now this game has been on my backlog of games I've been trying to play for quite some time now. It's a Ninja Theory game. I love their first outing with Heavenly Sword. I also really like DMC, the 2013 remake of Devil May Cry. And let's go ahead and uh, just get started. Now this is a very story heavy game. Um, I will try and keep the talking to a minimum so you guys can enjoy it as I play. Because I'm considerate like that. Welcome to Slave Ship 909, en route to Pyramid. You have been assessed, and any injuries sustained during your capture have been designated as non-life-threatening. Remaining journey time is estimated at 16 hours. If you are experiencing severe nausea or need to relieve yourself, I can a great position beneath your feet. <laughs> A new life awaits you, free from the random hazards of the wild. Compliance will be rewarded with safety and sustenance. Non-compliance will be rewarded with pain. Jeez. They're not fucking around. Temperature critical. Structural integrity 30%. Hey. Hey. Other. Other. Get out of that egg! Get out of that egg! I gotta say, Ninja Theory and friggin' Naughty Dog, they just kill it with faces. Oh, it's me. Oh. Alert! Prisoner loose in carriage 9! Prisoner loose in carriage 9! Oh, bitch. Affirmative, Slave 949. Combat mechs activating. Um, huh. Let's take a second. Look at this dude. Oh, oh, we got some texture pop out. <laughs> Still, I'm loving the scars on his arm. That's a prettier. I think they're brands, actually. Anyway, let's keep going. The main guy here, his name is Monkey, and I just cannot be more stoked about his character. Character setup with the uh, sash. Damn, not having a good day. Hello. Oh Alert. Powell Breach. Alert. Hull breach.
very Uncharted-ish, <laughs> but that's not a bad thing at all. It feels actually pretty good. Integrated slaves report to escape pods. Slaves escape pods? B and below now you're talking. Further commands. Yeah. Come on now. Uh, oh, I love that I don't have to balance on those poles. It's always the least favorite shit. Just kills all kind of momentum. It's against the rules. Item storage in the lower hall. <laughs> Street Fighter character. Damn. Oh man, there are not enough cool staffs in games. Like Donatello, Keelik from Soul Calibur, and that's about it, man. Okay, let's deal with that. Man. Monkey. All right, I've beat this part already, so I do know his name's Monkey. He's got definitely one of the best uh, staffs. That's gonna fuck up that map. Here we go. Ooh, come on. Not that I ran out of fire. Julia! There you go. So big now, huh? Shit. Combat mix. He's not active. This doesn't look like a training area at all. I'm sure none of these will come alive. Activating combat mech. Come on! Hey! Hey! Over the 
door! Oh yeah, he looks friendly. You mother! <laughs> Do our best not to fall to our death, monkey. That's what we do. Yeah. God, these jumps and stuff. Oh shit. It's just so fucking good. Oh. Phil thinks she can get out of here. You thought you could get away from me, huh, sugar?
I'm sure he's fine. Although I am a little curious what's up with this Art Nouveau-inspired Jason mask that's circling. I think that's a robot face. Maybe. Low time suck. Chapter 2. The Old City. Antelopes in New York. Burnt American flags. Shit got real. Well, at least he landed on a mattress. It's ripped open. It's the headband. <sighs> what? The slave headband. The one I fit on you. You put this on me. Let me explain. Get this thing off, or I'm gonna rip your head off. No. No? You think I'm screwing with you? You! Give me a stop! Ah! It works. Come in, move away from me. Ah! Oh. What the hell are you doing? I hacked a slave headband. Oh. So it could be activated by my voice commands. Ah. Activation triggers a systemic pain response. It's what controls the slaves. I'm gonna kill you. You can't. If my heart stops beating, for any reason, the headband will discharge a lethal dose. If I die, you die. Clever girl. Oh. <sighs> Why? I need your help. I come from a wind farmer community. It's about 300 miles from here. I'll never make it on my own. If slavers don't get me a mech will. That's the deal. Get me back to my home and you can go back to yours. Looks like I don't have a choice. I look like a king though. Neither of hmm? us do. I'm sorry. Okay. Let's go. Looks like from when the last time I played this, um, like a point that carried over. Is this the way out? Look at my cap door. That's that's lovely.
pieces in there. Okay. We're good, we're good. I think this must be a drawbridge. Must be to keep Max out. There are some controls here. The other side is blocked. Can you get around and clear it? Sure. Be careful. Voice down. They could be close. What are we gonna do? Not make too much noise. Oh. Jesus. Shit. Birds! Ah. Keep out of the way. Let me deal with this. There they are. That's so dope. Okay. It's all clear. Get over here. Coming. I always love those badass moments where it slows down or something. Something silly. Ooh. Where do I go? We could get out through here. Can you move this? I could try. She's daydreaming about. Bitch, we got mechs on our ass. We gotta go. Do you think you could tell me what the plan is? Rule one, don't die. Rule two, listen to me. Will Smith just walks out with a dog. To get you home as fast as possible so that you can take this thing off my head and I can break your neck. I meant... Y'all know what you meant. See that smoke over there? That's where the slave ship came down. First thing we're gonna do is head for that. Hoping my ride survived the crash. What's your ride? Uh, it's the only way I know how to cover 300 miles. Two wheels and an engine. Look at this place. There must have been thousands of people living here. More. Tens of thousands? Maybe. I don't remember what those little red orbs do. I think that's how they level up. Not 100%, though. Oops. Now engaging tutorial section.
Okay, so yellow means they're open. I think red was their attacking. I think the other one is blue. It's in their guard. Oh yeah! If we are gonna get through this, then when I ask you to do something, you need to do it immediately. Okay. I understand. Let's go. Hmm. I don't remember this at all. I think we can go this way. <laughs> Can she climb these things? Okay, cool. father gave it to me. Hmm. It knocks out small mechs for a few seconds. Enough to give me a chance to get away. Door? Oh. The security door is still functioning. Open it. There must be live power cells around here. Doesn't matter. We shouldn't get sidetracked. We just need to get to the crash site. Yay! Come back, go back, go back. Ass. 
I have some help over here. Uh, yeah, he's a decoy. He's a tiger. Got it. Hurry, hurry. Please, give me some time. Distract him. Don't worry about it. We got this. Come on, bitch. The big man now, huh? That's a nice touch, the gun's still going off. Alright. Well, guys, I think we're at about a 35-minute mark for this recording. I'm going to call it the end of episode one. I have to say, I love the two characters in this game. I love the setting. I love the robots. So I am really excited to keep playing this. I do want to thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys episode two, Enslaved Odyssey to the West. Monkey for fade out. Oh. <laughs>